I know oh, you like that. How long you been back, man? I see the girls in the club, they're getting wild. Yo, it's your boy K A N E, aka the Whiskey Boss. What's going on, peoples? Happy Thirsty Thursday. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. How's everybody doing? How's everybody doing? What's going on, Whiskey Bosses and Boss Sets? Salute, man. Yo, it's been a minute, but I'm back. I had a lot of stuff going on, house projects to do, man. So I couldn't really record like I wanted to because my area was full with stuff, man. But I'm back, man. And let's jump into it. Now, first of all, Thanks to all my subscribers. Thank you, man. Hey, I do this for y'all, man. I do this for y'all. Thank to all my subscribers. I think I'm like I just reached like 602. A hey, salute, man. That means a lot to the whiskey boss, man. Thank y'all sincerely, man. I appreciate y'all, and I do this for y'all. You hear me? Now let's get into it, man. Now this week's choice, the whiskey boss, man. Mitchers, y'all see this? Mitch's Bourbons, uh, small batch. This Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey is 47% alcohol, which means it's 91 proof. Y'all see it? Now, I uh, believe they have three usually bottles that you would usually see in uh, the liquor store. Uh, you see one that has the green label. I think that's a rye. And I forgot the other. The other kind is like this, but a little bit of darker label. But uh, this is the one I chose. Um, someone has actually suggested this. Y'all been suggesting this for a while. I've been seeing this in the liquor store for a while, but kind of hesitant on buying it because of the price. Some places I've seen this is $50. Some places I've seen it is $40, $45. And for the proof, it's kind of like, I don't, I don't know if I want to take that chance, man. I don't know if I want to take that chance, but I did it today. Um, well, I had it for a while. I had this bottle for almost a month or so, I believe. So I had some time to test it out, check it out, and um, give y'all what my honest review, man. You know, I keep it 100 on my channel, man. For look, listen, for all my new subscribers, I know all my old subscribers know. I keep it 100 on tasting. I don't sugarcoat nothing because I'm not getting paid for it by by nobody, by none of these companies. You know what I'm saying? If I like it, I like it. I don't, I don't. And a lot of people get to, you know what I'm saying, um, kind of like relate as far as, you know, what I'm talking about on my viewings and my tastes, man. So let's get into it, man. Y'all know how I usually do things on my channel, man. So why don't we get to doing it, you know? <laughs> now, first off, um, let me get y'all a color test first, man. Give it a little swig. Might have to go with the. Uh, it's not too dark. It's like a slightly burnt gold. Slightly burnt gold. Now that's 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 that. Now let me get out the nose. Sweet, sweet nose. Now on the nose, what I get is a um. A sweetness, it's like a kind of like a dried up cherry. Um, I'm trying to see, do fruit note. I'm gonna give it a straight fruit note. Smell a little bit of alcohol with a little of a, a bourbon barrel smell. A little bit, a little bit of that. Now this is batch number seven G one zero six two. So if somebody else got the same batch number with me, cheers, man. You know, sip it with me. I hope y'all can relate to what I taste on this. Now, uh, yeah, the nose is great, man. The nose is great. Now, this is the part we all been waiting on. This is the part where I ask all my uh, viewers that's viewing this right now, if y'all can, if y'all at work, don't do it. But if y'all at home chilling, go grab you a bottle of some, some, pull you something, and sip with the whiskey, boss. You hear me? Sit with your boy, man. Now, here it is. This is for all my subscribers. This is for all my new subscribers. Thank y'all. I'm glad to be back. Welcome back to my channel, and let's dig in. Cheers.
Okay. Mitchells. Small batch. When you first ship the Mitchells, small batch, you get a sweet note like that. Bam! As soon as it hits your palate, sweet note. It's a beautiful sweet note. It's very beautiful sweet note, but, excuse me, I got the fan on, but it disappears like that. It's gone like that. Um, it just magically disappears, and then it takes you to like an earth note, like a straight... like a straight earth note like a um hmm I don't want to say a wheat so it's like it's, it's, it's sweet and then it magically disappears then it takes you to like a a, 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 a barrel a barrel note with like a I guess I would say like a little hint of wheat. That's what I'm getting from it. So it starts off excellent, man. Like when you first sip it, boy, you first sip it, you get to woo your taste bud in there, like woo your taste buds in there dabbing, man. It's like, you know what I'm saying? But it disappears and it takes you on a total different road when you like, yo, hold on though, hold on. You like, you like, hold on, wait a minute, come back. Come back and it disappears. Uh, that's what I'm getting from this, man. And it's, 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 to me, that's disappointing. Like, it starts off great, man. It starts off, you know what? For those that never tasted, tasted this, this brand, Mitch, I'm going to tell y'all how it starts off. For those that like wild turkey red breed, that sweet tone that you get from wild turkey, Boom, you get that. You get that, then it's going like that. Now I said wild turkey red breed, not the wild turkey one on one or anything else. I'm talking about the red breed. The red breed to me is, is a little sweeter. Um this it has that, then it disappears, man. Yo, I gotta rate this, yo. Kane, aka the whiskey, boss. I give Mitchers. Small batch bourbon, man. I gotta get this. I got. I gotta do this, y'all. I'm sorry, but it has to be done. <laughs> oh man, this kind of crazy, man. This this kind of crazy. You know what? Hey, like I said, man. I don't get paid for this from nobody. So this is what I'm gonna do, man. I, I this is what I'm gonna do. Y'all can see that. The whiskey boss gave this a 5.5 out of a 10. A 5.5 out of a 10. Reason being because first of all, the price. Like you charging people 40 to 45 dollars in some place 50 bucks for this this brand, this bottle right here. And it's not worth it. I'm sorry, just, just ain't nothing else to say about it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it at all. Um, so the price played a big point to it. You get a sweet note, then it just cut, it just it disappears, and you like, damn man, you want that, you want to hold on to that sweet. You want to like hold on, big fella. Don't go nowhere, sweet fella. But pause. But it then it takes you like to a burl, like I don't want to say a nasty aftertaste, but it's, it's you you be, you get disappointed from it. And it's, it's, it's crazy, like, I don't understand how you start off sweet and then how it just dropped flat like that. Like, that's that's crazy to me. So, I gave it 5.5. 5 to me usually is a safe, a straight solid whiskey. It is it, it is a straight solid whiskey. Um, the point five I gave for the sweet taste that I like, man. So, I gave that that. The, sweet, the point five is the extra sweetness. But that's it. I'm not impressed. Will I buy it again? No, I'm not buying this again, man. I'm sorry, I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm. I stick to Wild Turkey Red Breed, Nile Creek Single Barrel, Wild Turkey One on One. I even, I even go with the, 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 
Old Granddad 1112, man. Or 114, I believe it is. One of them. 112. Wait, I think it's 114, man. This this not worth the money, y'all. Don't buy it. No, I'm not gonna tell y'all don't buy it. Try it out. If y'all might, some people might like it, but for me, I'm not impressed with it, man. Like, and, and the thing is, I see this on, on liquor stores on the shelves, and it just to me it just sit up there like I'm a badass. Like you see the name, like you like by itself, it'd be three bottles, it'd be this one, the green one, and the, and one just like this a little bit darker. Like my name is my name. You know what I'm saying? Like people like me because of my name. And to grab this, man, I'm totally, highly, highly disappointed, yo. Highly disappointed. But uh, that's my review, man. Would I would I recommend this? Uh, pros. You know what? It's kind of easy for for the for the for the for the uh, rookies. So it's not too harsh. Rookies, you can try it out. But take my advice. What I said, man. I'm disappointed in this product. Uh, it shouldn't be this this. It shouldn't be as much as it is, but that's my review, man. It's your boy, K-N-E, a.k.a. The Whiskey Boss. See y'all next Thursday. Thursday. Peace.